Ayo. Hey, yo. Yo. It's me, Loki. We, you know, the box that, you know, if you try to put me in a box, we outside the box. That's the box that if you try to put me in a box. So look, I'm going to be breaking down the meaning of colors and the meaning of numbers. Okay. And I'm only going to be going to like a little bit, but if you got any other color, any any uh, any other number that you want to ask, I want you to know though the real number count only goes to nine. Everything other than that is just a resemblance of one, two. Like I just want y'all to know, it's just like it's just an add-on. I just keep going. It's just an add-on from one, but every the the only like it only go up to nine for real. But <laughs> I'm finna I'm finna break it down. But it, it's all different meanings for, you know, specific numbers is, you know, a lot of shit. But, hey, right now I'm finna be breaking down these, these, these certain, you know, numbers, these certain colors. Okay? So, you know, I, I got I got a list here. And, you know, if, if it fly, it fly. If it don't, it don't. But, hey, this, this, this could be, this could be what is happening when you see the, the color yellow. You could be excited. Or expressive, or energetic, or fun light. So if you want, if you see the color yellow, this could be the space you in. Or if you want to p attract that energy to you, you put on yellow. Okay. All right. Now, blue communication, communicative, traveling, and ideas. So you could put on blue. This blue right here. You put blue on right. You could get more ideas. Or if if you if you see blue, this could mean that you know, yo, you need to be more expressive. You need to be more communicative. You gotta be a person of uh, expressing your ideas, you know. But wearing it, this is how you could uh, you know, attract it. Or when you traveling, put blue on, and you know it's gonna make it like more, like I wanna say faster, but like it's gonna go like more in your favor. Like when I say more in your favor. You have a higher chance of, you know, nothing going wrong when you when you leaving on uh, Wednesday, if you're driving on Wednesday, or wearing blue. But, hey, anything can happen, though. So, red, red represents passion and non-patient and violent and a connection. So, whenever you see, you know, me with red or you see, you know, red out there. But if I put on red, it's because, you know, I'm channeling all my passion into, like, you know, the specific sort of whatever I'm going for. If I'm going to be expressing passion, then I'll be expressing passion because I have red on. But if you see red, this means you need to be more passionate or you need to, you know, stop stop being, like, patient. Like, you got to be, stop waiting. You got to you gotta be a little impatient, not let nobody, you know, fuck with your little your time. Hopefully y'all can hear me because... I'll be far back behind the back the fucking the mic, but you know the wearing seeing red or you know having red on this could make you uh be a person who can you know connect easily like cause you will come at it from like uh like you gonna come at it hard like passionately like you gonna be invested into it. Just because, like, of the red, or say you go into a red room, you don't know why this room, you know, it, it make you, like, violent. Like, it make you, like, able to, you know, get out of character. And, you know, or, you know, say you with your, your, your vibe, your little girl, your, like, <laughs> when I say your little girl, usually the girl short, shorter than the dude. But, okay, because I, I'll, I'll promote, I'll promote, you know. Underage, I'll promote that shit. You get your ass shot of your head. Oh, God. Find out you messing with kids. You get your ass shot of your head. Oh, oh, didn't even care. Take me down. Shit, I'm shit. I'd rather go to jail for taking one out than let it happen. I don't know about <laughs> that's that's a whole That's a whole different, you know, video. But 
this world's fucked up anyway. I ain't gonna lie. It's a fucked up world. But, you know, yeah, so you see red or put it on. You can be more connected to in, into what you're doing, be more passionate. And, you know, it'll make you not patient, though. So that's the bad side of it. But if you see orange, you know, you see orange right now in my little, but, but, little, little thing. So, you know, educate educational uplifting experiencing and rising up so you know if you want to put orange on you can rise up out your lower nature put an orange on go eat an orange shit you know and like th this also can work if you eat these things like eat anything red eat anything blue i think like a blue smoothie that's <laughs> but you know um or you know wearing these colors these colors could you know get you in these vibrations like all these colors and numbers are vibrations so once you are in when you ride in a when your spirit is riding a specific vibration you know you're going to start to see from that frequency get get uh ideas from that frequency get um get you know some some type of energy from that frequency like spirits are going to be a in that in that in that in that frequency current so you'll get the vibe but um yeah so you know if you see orange or you want to, you know, be a, like a teaching, you know, put put some or you want to uplift something or uplift people, you know, wear orange. You know, it's a it's a it's a powerful color. I purple. So seeing purple means, you know, you could be sad or wearing it can make you, you know, give off a sad energy or seeing purple can mean, you know, you're feeling guilty about something rem remorseful repent and you're sorry so like if you see if you see any of these colors or say you finna apologize because you made a mistake you could wear you could wear purple it'll go more in your favor if you didn't wear purple but you know seeing these specific colors you know it could it infamize that like if you don't know what space your spirit in it could tell you that you know you sad right now you feeling guilty right now you don't have no remorsefuls you know you you repent it. You don't feel like getting up. You in hermit mode, and and you always feeling sorry. So this like and this also can be a place that your spirit in. Your spirit is too is in too much yellow. You too excited. Your spirit in too much of blue. You too communicative. Your spirit too much in red. You too passionate. Your spirit too much in orange. You too you know uplifting. You or you're experiencing too much. You know or you need to go experience. Like it also it also represents um things you need to do also things that that you can do right or things that you can get or something that's happening but with venus this this could be you know pleasure desire self-centered and your your loving so it's like whenever you are you know in a pacific space where you're opening your heart chakra you're opening your heart you know you you might um Go to your lower desires, aka Venus, and your pleasures, and you might be self-centered when when you are, you know, in your Venus. Like you're not, you're not necessarily caring about shit. You just it's all about me. It's my show. I'm feeling myself, type of shit. But just you know, with your desires, have it in moderation, and value work over pleasure but pleasure it has time for pleasure just no time pleasure have its own time work has its own time you can balance it but don't 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 put them in the same thing all right green represents growth and grounding and gasping and discernment so if you wear green this could you know help you stay grounded or if you see in a bunch of green you know it's telling you to use your discernment all right, so if you see brown or wearing brown, this could be meaning that, you know, you're in laziness, boredom, you are chronical, meaning that, you know, you're not able to get the fuck off your ass or you're being judgmental, meaning you're not allowing a situation to happen how it's supposed to happen. You're judging it before it even occurs, before it even pop off. You're prejudging so don't be prejudging but you know if if you wanna if you wanna like you wanna if you wanna know that you being a, a type of energy you like I, I guess you know i could be being a little bit of lazy doing these videos instead of what i what i usually what i'm supposed to do 
Because, <laughs> like, I'm supposed to be, because uh, I'm going to be going on, like, a vacation. So I'm going to be posting, like, I'm supposed to get, like, you know, 24 clips. I only got, like, 10 of them. So it's, like, so it's, like, I could be, I'm being a little bit lazy. But, you know, I, I'm not really being lazy. I'm still doing work. It's just I'm not finishing the work that I know that I want to have done before I go on my vacation. So, yeah, if you see you see brown, you see you know this color, this could this could this could represent you know you bored, you being too judgmental, you're lazy as fuck. <laughs> but I right, look so the black represents you know be like a sh- be like a charmanter, shamanlander, fuck nigga, be like a uh, one of those things that blend in, like. Be able to, uh, uh, excuse me, excuse me, be able to blend in in environments that, you know, others can't. If you in a hood, become a hood nigga. If you in, if you, if you in a fucking, the suburbs, become a suburban. If you a fucking, if you're a fucking worker, become the fucking worker. If you, if you, if you with the, um... The cartels become a mob boss, like, like, be a chameleon. So you know, be able to you know, blend in with whoever. If you if you with the broke people, you broke that day. I ain't say be broke. I say you broke that day, just that day. Not not always, just that day. So they don't ask you for no money. If you with the sad people, you sad just that day. So they don't, they don't come and try to make you sad, and take your sadness. You with the happy people, be overly excited. Shit, I could be happy too, shit. <laughs> but look, 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 look. If you see black, you know, you know, this could mean that you need to start observing, be observant, and, you know, start to get active and subtle. Be be smooth with it. Don't be, like, choppy. Don't be be smooth, like, 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 be like, be like. Don't be like, don't do that. Don't do that. So if you or put on black, put on black. You put on black. This this black is gonna make you, you know, able to blend in, able to you know, attract uh, a subtle a subtle you know way of moving. So it's like just take it. Just take just take your uh your time if you see black or if you wanna be a person who. Who more subtle, who more chill, more relaxed, put on some black. And you know, we finna get into the numbers now. So one represents <laughs> one represents selfishness or self-sacrificing. Two represents non-selfishness and go or gullible. Three, like if you see these numbers or you know your life path this number. But it even go it even goes deeper than that. But three, one for all, objective, individual, or two-faced. Logical is the fourth one. Thinking or thinking too hard. Fifth one, emotional reactor or caregiving and comfort. You could be, you know, you see these numbers. I'm, I'm going to break it down real fast and I'm going to break it down like a little in, individually. Six, charismatic or in creative and atten- seeking, attention seeking. Seven, knowing how to do or be being high solidated. Eight, strong or or a lot of time spent alone. Nine, wise, knowledgeable, or unlucky and scary. So listen, whenever you are seeing like a certain number or a certain color, or, and it makes you feel some type of way, that is, you know, the energy that you are seeing float around your environment. So you will be able to, since I just broke this all down to you, so whenever you are, you you are, you know, you you see one, you could be either too self, selfish or self-sacrificing. And if you see two, you could be non-selfishness, not showing, you like you just, you just, you know, you care all about them. Or, you know, you can be too gullible. And three, if you if you see three, it means 
one for all objectives, individual or two faced. Somebody's being two faced if it, or if you see that, or everybody is for one each other. But it's up to you to you know be the sensei to tell which which or if it is. But fourth, logically thinking or thinking too hard. So if you see four, you might need to logically think. But if you're thinking already, that means you're thinking too hard. So if you see five, it means don't be emotionally reactive. Or you're caring and giving and you're comforting. But over emotional reactor is like, you know, a person, they they had miscommunication with you. And then you overreacted. And then, you know, the sixth one, this could mean that you are charismatic. Or you're being creative and you, you're you trying to also... Wait, wait, wait. No, hold on, I said that all wrong. So, look. If the sixth one, this means that you're being charismatic and, char- char- charismatic, charismatic and you're being creative. Or you're attention seeking. So, you will have to see the, the switch. So, people... Because people can sense this, too. Like, other spirits can sense this, too. So, if... If you on the opposite end of just attention seeking, then they're gonna be able to sense that. But or if you just being charismatic and creative, then they're gonna be able to, you know, um, sense that as well. Seven, knowing how to do, knowing how to do or be high satiety. So being high satiety, this means that you don't really know what you're doing. You just acting like you do. But if you're seeing seven, it means that you know you 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 know it can mean you know how to do it. And just look, when you see these, this is like signs. From angels, really just signs from yourself because you'd be speaking to yourself in colors and numbers. But you see these signs, it's telling you a confirmation. Go for it. Eight, a strong aura, or you spend a lot of time alone. You spend a lot of time in that room, or you spend a lot of time with that vibrator if you're a girl. Shit. <laughs> but, or you can have a strong aura, meaning you work on yourself. And you, what you, what you pay attention to, people can sense that off of you. What, what you're working on, people can, they can feel that from you. What you're watching, people could, you know, get that from just you, you know, how you move. And then nine, you're wise, knowledgeable, or unlucky and scary when you feel, you know. So. So look, you could either be wise when you see nine or knowledgeable. This could be telling you. Or it's unlucky and scary. So so no, like you can be able to see the difference. You could be tell tell how your your emotional reaction. Like if you feeling scary and you see nine, it means it's an unlucky time. Whew. Yeah. <sighs> but if you got any, you know, other questions, any c- other colors, it's common them. It's common them. It's common them. And you can go experience this yourself. If you want to go be more excited, more expressive, go put on some yellow. If you want to, you know, if you want some one of your friends to, you know, try to get you to come outside, put some, some, put some blue on. Or go put some blue on and go for a walk. You might start a conversation just because you went outside and had blue on. Look at all bright and colory and shit. If you finna make a song, you need some passion, put some red on. Shit. If you wanna be uplifted, go 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 put go eat an orange or you know Put orange on and watch like some motivational videos. So after you watch that mo- those motivational videos on that orange is going, you know, it's going to and just like with the attention that the orange is absorbing all the motivational words that they saying. And then, you know, when you put that that hoodie on or that, that shirt on or that 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 whatever do rag, whatever orange you put on, when you put it on, you get uh you get every you like all the the words that they were trying to put you in. You get you just you get that you get that when you put it on. And you know, purple. You know, put put some purple on, or if you want somebody to feel sorry, I don't even should be teaching y'all this shit. You know, g- g- like look, you could wear purple, and you could try to guilt guilt trip them, gaslight them, manipulate them, put them into a perspective where, you know, 
they feel like they did wrong. But you know, I'm not. I, I can't. I can't. I can't keep doing this shit with y'all. So y'all can use this against me. Hell no. Nah. <laughs>